We're in Office 365. I'm going to show you how to add a user to a group. Let's go ahead and click on the admin icon, assuming you are an admin. And from here, we're going to click on edit a user. So let's talk about what a group is. Go ahead and click on Jane Doe. And now we're going to see the option for group membership. So if your exchange administrator has created a group, then you're going to be able to assign people to those groups. And what this allows us to do in this case is we've created a group called accountants. And so we've created an email address called accountants at our domain name, whatever your domain name is. And so if someone emails accountants at our domain name, then it's going to show up to everyone who's a member of this group. And it can happen both internally or from anyone out on the internet. So let's go ahead and click on edit group membership. So Jane is an accountant. So let's go ahead and add her in to our accountants group. Now this is the only group that we've created so far and in upcoming videos, you'll see how to create those groups. Go ahead and click the checkbox. It says accountants and click save. And you can see just before I click save that the email address accountants at our domain name is how people are going to get to her. It has succeeded and now we can click close and close once again. And we can see that Jane is now a member of the accountants group. Now she can be a member of a lot more groups. It doesn't have to be just one group, but this is the only group membership we have at this time. Let's go ahead and click close and stay tuned for new up upcoming videos that will explain all about groups, how to create them and edit them.